Hello Gemini, I hope you're doing well. This is reading the message for November 14. Please keep in mind for that there is that this is a general reading. This is not a one-on-one -on -one reading. So this will not resonate with everyone. Just take what resonates for and leave what doesn't for someone else. And now, uh, wag po ninyong ipilit mag-fit sa inyo ang reading kung hindi po tugma sa inyong circumstances. Dahil ibig sabihin po yan, hindi po para sa inyong specific message na yan. Thank you. And also, maraming salamat po sa pag-subscribe sa aking channel. Thank you for your support. And kung bago naman po kayo dito, hello and welcome. Please subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell po para updated kayo sa mga readings. And uh, Gemini, naway lagi po kayo safe at healthy lamang. Yun po ang aking laging dasal para sa inyong lahat. And uh, yung mens mensahe po ninyo ngayon is the Ace of Water. Wow, napakaganda Gemini. This is a very, very beautiful energy. This is the Divine Universe handing you blessings, no? Uh, yung cup mo dito, if uh, some of you, you know, running empty na ang iyong cup, uh, ito na yung panahon, no? Ito na yung energy na, na sinasabi nito na blessings are, are going to be out pouring, no? Para sa iyo. So, ito na yung panahon na yung Divine Universe is going to refill your cup. Your needs will be met dito. And, uh, kung ano yung, yung kailangan, no? Talagang uh, mabibigyan ka or makukuha mo yan in different ways. So, ano to? Madaming blessing. Iba't ibang klase. Depende sa inyong sitwasyon. Maaring ito yung hinihingi mong trabaho. Maaring you are in need ngayon ng uh, source of income. So, maaring merong job offer sa yung dumating. Maaring merong uh, opportunity to put up a business or an opportunity to earn money quickly. Alam mo yun? Or, you know, maaring this is an opportunity of a business partnership, no? Na maaring yun ang magdadala sa iyo ng financial abundance. Para sa iba naman sa inyo dito, maaring this is a new love interest. If you are looking for a new love, uh, looking for a new relationship, so maaring ito na yun. Maaring ito na yung blessing na yan, na yung uh, pinagpipray, na yung uh, dinadasal, no? Na hinihintay ninyo na makilala ninyo ang isang uh, tao na yung pala ang, alam mo yun, mag magbibigay uh, sa iyo ng inspiration na magmamahal sa iyo alam mo yon yung aalagaan ka so maaring ito na yon de ba kung ikaw ay single at ikaw ay nagdadasal ng ganoon sitwasyon so maaring ito na yun yung pagkakataon ang iba naman sa inyo you know maaring meron na kayong bahay na titirhan, maaaring nakikitira lang kayo sa kamag-anak or kaibigan, and now finally, no, you will be given that opportunity na makabili ka ng sariling bahay or maaaring magkaroon ka na ng uh, inheritance no, in the form of bahay, so maaaring ganun or or maaaring meron na kayong nakuhang rarantahang bahay no, but this is a, a good one no, kasi this is matatawag mo yung yung meron kang privacy ng ng ikaw lang or yung iyong pamilya lang ang nandiyan, di ba? So, maaaring ganun ang sitwasyon uh, ng iba sa inyo dito, Gemini. And uh, for for some of you as well, Gemini, yung intuition is going to be on point, no? Your psychic abilities are on fire ngayon. So be on the lookout for that uh, intuitive messages and messages because maaring uh, yun ang makakatulong sa yung situation ngayon, whatever your situation is, na alam mo yun, i-guide ka towards the right path, towards the right direction, towards the right choice, kung meron kayong pagpipilian. But overall, no, this is a very, very beautiful energy because this is a, a beautiful blessing coming in for you, Gemini. So that's all I have for you for today. I hope nakatulong ang reading nito in some way. Thank you for watching. Love and light. Namaste. Hello Libra, I hope you're doing well. This is your daily message for November 14. Please keep in mind po that this is a general reading. This is not a one-on-one -on -one reading. So, this will not resonate with everyone. Just take what resonates po and leave what doesn't for someone else. And uh, wag po ninyong ipilit mag-fit sa inyo ang reading kung hindi po tumang sa inyong circumstances. Dahil ibig sabihin po niyan, hindi po para sa inyong specific na mensahe na yan. Thank you. And maraming salamat din po sa inyong pag-subscribe sa ating channel. Thank you for your support. Kung bago naman po kayo dito, hello and welcome. Please subscribe, like, share, 
and hit the notification bell po para updated kayo sa mga readings. Thank you. And then, di pa lang naway lagi po kayong safe at healthy lamang. Yun po ang aking laking dasal para sa inyong lahat. And uh, Libra, yung message mo for today is the Queen of Fire. So, Libra, parang uh, meron ka ditong goal, no? Meron kang tinatarget dito na goal. Talagang uh, disidido, disidido ka naman na makamit mo yon. Disidido ka na ma-accomplish mo yon, Which is very, very beautiful. Kasi uh, gustong gusto ko yan. <laughs> On a personal note, gustong gusto ko yan na kung meron kang goal, sige lang, go for it. By hook or by crook, go for it. Ganon. Uh, kaya, tuwan-tuwa ako kapag lumalabas si Queen of Fire. So, sinasabi ng energy na to for you, Libra, na uh, there is no playing small here. So, that's why napakagandang energy nito because finally, you know, uh, you are going to be on your feet. You're going to uh, spread your wings and you're going to fly high. Talagang, ano ka ngayon? You're going to come out into the open na, yeah, ako to. I am capable of doing this. I am capable of doing that. And I'm I'm capable of of being successful. Yung parang ganun, ganun ang vibe ni ni Queen of Fire for me as a reader, no? And then this is beautiful kasi ah uh, pagtatagumpayan mo 'yan. I am pretty sure Libra. Na kung ano man yung devil mo na yan, no? Kung ganito ang ang iyong uh, nasa puso, yung yung energy ni Queen of Fire talagang tagumpay ka, hindi ka dyan mag-fail because you're being, you're being so decisive and uh, talagang uh, iron the price ka. So talagang dere-derecho ka dyan. Once na nagsimula ka dyan sa endeavor na yan, you are not going to stop no somewhere. But you're going to stop when you reach your goal. Doon lang ang end point mo. Doon ang finish line mo. Wala kang ibang pupuntahan but to get your target. So, So, this is beautiful for you. So, good luck, Libra. That is such a beautiful energy for you. And that's all I have for you for today. Hope nakatulong ang reading nito in some way. Thank you for watching. Love and light. Namaste. Hello, Aquarius. I hope you're doing well. This is your daily message for November 14. And please keep in mind po that this is a general reading. This is not a one-on-one -on -one reading. So, this will not resonate with everyone. Just take what resonates po and leave what doesn't for someone else. And wag po ninyong ipilit mag-fit sa inyo ang reading kung hindi po tumang sa inyong circumstances. Dahil ibig sabihin po niyan, hindi po para sa inyong specific message na yun. Thank you. And maraming salamat din po sa pag-subscribe sa aking channel. Thank you for your support. Kung bago naman po kayo dito, hello and welcome. Please subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell po para updated po kayo sa mga readings. Thank you. And uh, naway lagi po kayong safe at healthy lamang. Yun po ang aking laging dasal para sa inyong lahat. So, yung mensahe ninyo for today, Aquarius is the nine of air. Ang iba sa inyo are having sleepless nights. Ang iba sa inyo nagigising in the middle of the night dahil um, sa kakaisip, no? Uh, ang iba sa inyo dito, Aquarius, maybe you are overthinking. Maybe you are uh, thinking too much, no? In anticipation to something, no? Iniisip nyo na yung mga maaring maganap or maaring dumating or maaring mangyari, no? In the near future. And uh, that is causing you stress, no? Kasi... Uh, ang nakakapag-stress sa inyo dito, yung kaiisip ninyo ng hindi pa naman nangyayari, ba? Diba? Yung uh, nai-imagine nyo lang kung ano yung maaring mangyari, kung anong maaring mang Uh, maaring dumating sa sa buhay mo maaring dumating sa sitwasyon mo yung parang ganun yun ang mensahe ng, ng energy na ito for you Aquarius no? na dumadaan sa ganitong sitwasyon ngayon is uh, stop worrying no? kasi uh, unang una dapat ang isipin nyo ngayon is yung yung iyong well-being, no? Yung iyong kapakanan, yung iyong kabutihan, no? Kasi kung magpapatalo ka diyan sa stress, sa pagwo-worry, sa kakaisip at kakaisip ng problema na hindi pa naman problema, nako Aquarius, hindi lang 'yan ang magiging problema mo kundi pati uh, health issues magkakaroon ka din yan. Kaya ang sinasabi ng uh, card na to, yung reminder ng energy nito for you is stop worrying and instead 
look at uh, the positive aspect ng iyong sitwasyon. Kung ano man yung iyong sitwasyon ngayon, tignan mo na lang kung ano yung uh, silver lining nito. Tignan mo na lang kung uh, ano yung positive na aspect nito. At doon ka mag-focus, doon mo uh, ibaling ang iyong atensyon. No? Kasi uh, kung meron ka man problema ang pinagdadaanan ngayon, uh, when you look into the positive aspect lang, mas makakaisip ka ng solusyon na mas mabilis. Mas makakaisip ka kung paano mo maiiwasan ang magka-problema. Mas makakaisip ka ng diskarte, no? Kung papaano ka na uh, makaiwas sa mga posibleng uh, maging problema, di ba? So, try to transmute that negative thoughts into positive one. Kasi, uh, Aquarius, be reminded as well na makapangyarihan ang ating mga iniisip, di ba? Kung ano yung ating iniisip, yun ang nangyayari. So, that is like a um, self-prophesying. Yung iniisip mo kung, kung uh, let's say for example, ang nasa isipan natin is negative thoughts. Na kung nag attract din tayo niyan ng mga negative experiences, negative situations. Kaya, mas maigi na ang lagi na lang nating isipin is yung positibo lang para yung ma-attract natin sa buhay natin, na mag-manifest sa buhay natin, ay panay positive lang, panay maganda lang din, di ba? Kasi, di ba, sabi nga, what we think is what we create. Kaya, maigi na lang na doon lang tayo sa maganda. Maigi na lang na doon na lang tayo sa laging positibo para yun din ang mangyari sa buhay natin. So, Aquarius, that's all lang for you for today. I hope nakatulong ang reading na ito in some way. Thank you for watching. Love and light. Namaste.